Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Aura Dandelion and I'm so glad you could join me today. Let's just ignore the fact that I've been gone for a while and that's a story for another day because <laughs> in today's video I'm going to be showing you my skincare routine. Um, I've recently just got into a proper proper skincare routine or just one me is or two years. But I think I've perfected my go-to skincare routine, my skincare routine that is just holding me down. So before, my skincare routine was mainly to target my dryness that I had in my skin. But now, I'm focusing more on trying to lighten my hyperpigmentation on my face. And I think it's doing what it's supposed to be doing. But I feel like I'll probably properly get it fixed from the dermatologist. So these are just products that are helping me right now. And yeah, so let's get right into this. And also, nobody asked me, but it's here now. <laughs> So the first product I'm going to use is the Pure Clarifying Cleanser from The Body Shop. But basically I like this cleanser because it's not foaming and it doesn't give me those bubbles on my face, which I don't enjoy. I find them to be very drying. So it foams but in a, in a, in a soapy but not... Let me show you. Basically let me show you. But this is basically... Um, giving my skin moisture while trying to lighten up the hyperpigmentation that I do have on my face. So it's a winner and I've been repurchasing the, this product because I really believe in this product. So your first step is to wet your face and then take about this much and then you just rub it into your face. And you do this step for about 60 seconds and I learned this from Aunt Jackie so it really does help get the product working if you use it for 60 seconds and not less. So do you guys see what I mean when I say it's foaming but it doesn't give you that foam, the normal foam that you usually get from cleansers. Okay then once I'm done washing my face I just use my face cloth to wipe off the water oh snap i forgot that i'm scrubbing today that's fine i'll just use my other cleanser so initially i was going to use my microdermabrasion cleanser from the body shop this is the vitamin c one i love using this one when i'm feeling like my skin is just mm. I don't know how to explain that feeling but when you feel like your skin is just like crying and this is the one I love to use um, but today I'm going to be using my liquid peel from the body shop this is uh, from the same range as the moisturizer so how this works is that it's a liquid peel so you take about two drops and then you just rub it on your face like so and then you're gonna want to focus on the areas where you feel like you need the product the most and you're just going in circular motion up until you get these white this white residue on your face sometimes it does take a long time to show but usually it doesn't take too long and then you're gonna rinse this off immediately. And so I never, I never really had a proper skincare routine up until I started seeing results in my sister's skin. So she had started doing the, is it a seven step or something skincare routine? And I was like, no man, I also need to fix my skin because it's a looking complainer and doing nothing about it. How is that gonna help me? So um, before I literally only used to use the green bar 
sun lighting and then my body lotion and uh, that was it literally that was it the next step after that I go in with my serum this is the drops of light pure healthy brightening serum um, this one I use on a daily basis in the morning just to help me with my pigmentation and then sometimes if I feel like I need moisture then I'll go in with the switch beauty one so this is the oh my camera sucks I'll put everything on the side so this is the water gel hydrating plumping serum so it depend, depends on how I'm feeling that day um, as to which product I use and then with this I go in with four drops and then you just you can pat or you can rub it into the skin I like to rub products into my skin I do not like patting I just never understand patting the product unless the product asks for you to pat, your, pat it into your skin then of course I'll do it but swipe Okay, so we're going to let that sink into our skin. The next product that I go in with is this essence from the body shop as well. So this essence, it's a pure translucency essence lotion. I'll put everything on the screen as well, but it's meant to help with brightening your skin. So the lady at the body shop suggested that I buy this because I asked about a toner. And I just do not like toning. It's a step that I always forget. So I was like, please can you suggest me something that I can use in place of a toner that I know I'll, I won't forget, I won't leave out. So that is why I have an essence. Cha! As before, but like once you're into it, you're gonna, you're gonna learn. And then I just take this and I just rub it into my skin. And the other week I had done, um, what is it called, lash extensions. I was in hell. I was in hell. The fact that I couldn't wash my face properly, like, no, I'll never do them again. Literally, no, I like to get into it, so it's just not for me. Shusansi, you're only bad bitch. Shame for me. And then I feel like this product has changed my life. I go in with either the Superhero Spray Gloss Edition or the normal one. As you can see, this is my favorite one. I love this product. Um, I just, I just, my skin eats this thing up. But I find this so moisturizing and it just gives my skin that extra glowy look i have extremely dry skin so my skin loves any bit of moisture that you give to it so you just spray this into your face you do not need as much pumps as i used just i just need it it's winter and uh, i'm going through a lot so with me when it comes to skincare i like to stick with products that are from the same line just so that i can make it work better in a sense so my moisturizer is also from the drops of light range and this is the pure healthy brightening day cream and i love the consistency of this product it just gives me all that moisture that i need and that my skin loves before I was using the one from the vitamin E range, I don't know if you guys remember from my past videos, but I used to love that moisturizer. And also another moisturizer that I use is the one from Neutrogena. Uh, I'll put a, a picture on the screen so you guys can see what it looks like. But I feel like it's not thick enough for me. My skin needs more thickness more juiciness so that is why i don't use it like as a part of my skincare routine i'll use it maybe when i'm doing my makeup i know you're not supposed to put the product around your eyes but i just i just do because i don't use i i i try to use eye cream it just doesn't work for me i don't know i don't know if i'm missing if you're a little age it's okay now i need eye cream then i'll use it even though you're supposed to be using it as something to prevent 
um, your eye go aging and then once I'm done doing that I go in with my <laughs> I go in with my sunscreen okay hear me out hear me out okay so it, it was finished I've ran out and I need to buy more so I just cut it open I don't know who still does this let me know in the comments if you still do this when your products are finishing but this is the sunscreen that I use I swear by the sunscreen it's from Nivea um, it looks like this and it's just non greasing it does what it's supposed to do I love this product and I'm definitely going to buy more I didn't I didn't have time so definitely going to buy this again and that three that three finger or what two finger rule about sunscreen and again again shame again more shame if i can see that it's going in the right area or where it's supposed to go then i'm good but you can miss me <laughs> you can miss me cha yeah, you can miss me no i tried it the one time because i was like let me see and no, you know when your skin feels like and it's just rubbing off the product. That's how I felt and I was like, no ways. I'm good with the amount that I put on. It does what it's supposed to do and yeah. So this is how my skin is looking. Glowy, juicy, everything that's good. It's perfect. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching my video. Please do like, comment and subscribe to my channel. And do let me know down below if you found any of this information helpful. If you figured out something about a product that you were thinking about using um, in this video. Please let me know in the comments down below. And do let me know what else you guys would like to see. I will be trying to get more... Give you guys more content um i think i found a schedule i think i found something that that is gonna work for me there's just been a lot going on and i don't even know if i want to do a live update video because it's me i'm not that important <laughs> i'm not that important because oh, guys so i've been going through this 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 no maybe in the next video um when i'm doing the chit chat get ready with me Anyways, I love you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!